Hello, I'm Michael Caskey. I'm one of the pastors at the Ironton Presbyterian Church, and I'm bringing a daily devotional for July the 18th from uh, my grandfather's devotional book. It's from 1944, and it's really good. The book is the people who wrote it were uh, true believers. They believed the Bible. And today, the um, title of the devotional is Praying for Others. And it says to read James 5, 16 through 18. And the author picked out this part. It says, pray for one another. And here's what he says. James, who was the leader of the Christian work in Jerusalem, urged the members of the church to pray for one another. In many places, the Bible tells us to pray for others as well as for ourselves. What we know about the needs of others is a call to pray for them. We ought to remember in prayer, especially the Christian workers on our mission fields at home and in foreign lands. How encouraging it must be for them in difficult situations to know that there are those who are praying for them. And here he quotes someone else's work. It says, The weary ones had rest, the sad had joy, that day and wondered how. A plowman singing at his work had prayed, Lord, help them now. Away in foreign lands, they wondered how their simple word had power. At home, the Christians, two or three, had met to pray an hour. Yes, we are always wondering, wondering how, because we do not see. Someone unknown, perhaps, and far away on bended knee. Amen. Now, I'm going to read this prayer that he includes, and you're welcome to claim this, and you should. Then add whatever's on your mind and your heart and your life to it. Let us pray. We thank thee, Lord, for those who pray for us and ask thee to make us constant in prayer for those who are our friends and thine. Bless all our missionaries in China, Africa, and India, and throughout the world, and all who labor faithfully in thy work in the homeland. For Jesus' sake, amen. We could add a whole list of other places where the workers are laboring, actually in danger of their own lives. They're out there doing the work. Amen.